So we did everything we could to elongate this fire, but mm. nothing was working. Okay, yeah. there, there was only there was only so much we could ration out this firewood. I think with, I think the last log lasted like us for like for a full hour. There's, uh, there's only so many like tiny little twigs you find on the on the paddock, right? <laughs> yeah. That where it's like, yes, this will do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember there was a tree next to where I pissed, and I like I like picked up the leaves, right? <laughs> and I'm just like, okay, these dead leaves, these these will work. And they yeah. gave us like like a microsecond of heat, and that that yeah. felt like that felt like to me at the time like a full ten minutes. Right? Right? Yeah, yeah. We we start we start like using the fucking uh we, we start using like the beer packaging. So it was like we had like <laughs> we had like all the cardboard packaging and we were like we went from using the beer cardboard to like rationing it as like a, as like a as like a big burst of heat because yeah, that would yeah. give that give us like a nice big burst of heat for like a good five seconds. <laughs> We'd all crowd around and we were like, "All right, boys, when do we do the next one? When do we use the next one?" And we eventually just I can't wait any longer. <laughs> we eventually just didn't even drink the beers, but we just still unwrapped unwrapped the beers yeah. with all the packaging so we could use it as fuel. But uh, we should have recycled, but yeah. instead we needed heat. Yeah, yeah. But uh, eventually, eventually. Uh, we ran out of things to burn. I know, guys. I know. Ran it's, out of uh, resources. I know. My... So I put Gaunt in the fire. <laughs> Unfortunately, he didn't burn. <laughs> um, so eventually, that was when we realized we uh, had to go to bed. Um, and uh, so we packed everything up. And at rem- this point, it was maybe around minus one, minus two. It was starting to get pretty yeah, fucking it's, it's, cold. It was starting to get pretty, really cold. Yeah, uh, yeah about it was like neg- negative degrees. Mm. Um, for you Americans, that's a uh, negative from the boiling uh, from the freezing point of water. So <laughs> I don't know what the freezing point of water is in Fahrenheit, but 32. it was it was below that. Below thirty two. Why is it thirty two? It's thirty two Fahrenheit. Is zero degrees Celsius. Oh, okay. Yeah. I didn't know that. I, I think did, I did not know that. It's either. thirty something. I'm pretty sure. Right. <laughs> yeah. Thirty three point eight is one degree Celsius. Yeah. 32, 32 is zero. So it was like maybe like 28 Fahrenheit. Um, And this is when we came to realize how cold it really was going to be uh, without even like a piddly little fire to Mm. uh, heat us up. And I remember me and Connor uh, went into our tent first. So me and Connor slept with Nabby in his tent and Joey and Luke slept in another tent and everyone else slept in a third tent. Um, and I remember Connor jumping in, right? Connor jumping in and just realizing how flimsy and thin yeah. his his sleeping bag was. I, I literally had gotten a raincoat that had just been fashioned into. It was like it didn't it didn't have any padding yeah. or anything, and I was uh, like, "This is what I get yeah, for ordering the only available sleeping bag on Amazon for next before. day delivery." Yeah, because yeah. I remember it was, like, it was like twenty bucks. Yeah, because yeah. I remember I think the warmest coat you have by far is your drip jacket. Yeah. And this was the one time in the past month, I think I've seen you without the drip jacket, Listen. where it would have been very, very useful, yeah. I mind you. The reason I didn't bring it, right, is because we were gonna be burning a lot of shit. And I was like, I didn't want to get this this nice jacket that I paid yeah. way too much money yeah. for, super smoky. And I, it's probably gonna be messy too. Yeah. It yeah. was messy. I dropped condiments everywhere. I was like, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just leave that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wish I did, Yeah, but. Yeah, so Connor like fucking gets in the sleeping bag and soon realizes that this is not going to be fucking warm enough at all. Mm. And he just gets over and he's like, Gun, Gun, I give you permission to cuddle me. Gun, <laughs> we are cuddling tonight. I'm like, Connor, we don't need to cuddle. We don't need to cuddle. And then I get into the tent and I realize, fuck, we're gonna need to cuddle tonight, Connor. <laughs> so so like, I, 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 t- I take off my jacket as, like, as fast as possible. And then, I, and then I try to like get in the sleeping bag and I zip myself up, I'm fucking freezing. And I, and I, like, I start like, like two caterpillars next to each other, like fucking cuddling with each other. And then that still isn't warm enough. So I, I kind of realize pretty soon that I have to sleep with my jacket on because yeah. even yeah. with my jacket off, it's not going to be warm enough. Um, luckily at this point, I think we were pretty drunk, right? Yeah, we yeah I must say it was very funny from the other tent when all I could hear was, God, cuddle me now, <laughs> get closer to me. <laughs> I'll freeze. I'll be the small spoon. You be the large spoon, cuddle me now. Listen, I've seen enough bad girls to know what to do. I, you know, I, I knew what I needed to Drink do. Drink my yeah. piss now. <laughs> God, I fashion- for survival. God, don't ask, but I fashioned my jeans into a piss filter. I'm already drinking the water. You can go next. I've already pissed in it, Gun. Uh, I, I was I think I was wearing like maybe six layers. I, I had fashioned my my spare t shirt and yeah. put it around my neck as a neck warmer. <laughs> <'Cause laughs> yeah, 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 because it was so cold. What, okay, what was the coldest part of your body? What was the part that was hurting? Uh, my feet. feet. Yeah, it's the feet for me too. Yeah. I was wearing the family mask socks. That didn't help. Yeah. So I, <laughs> I, one time I, I was, was also like, wearing the family mask socks. I, I, was, family mask I, was, I was rocking a pair of jeans. It was fine. My legs were fine, honestly. Yeah. Yeah. That wasn't a problem. I was wearing a long sleeve, thin shirt with the 
big thick jumper yeah. and I went to bed using my coat as the pillow because I didn't have a pillow. Yeah. yeah. Woke up at like 2 a.m. I think, so I was too cold yeah. and I put the jacket on. It didn't really help much yeah. um, because by that point I was already too cold. And, and I the feel jacket like, was ice cold. I yeah. feel like, yeah, because I was too cold. So yeah. like the, I, I wasn't heating up at all. Yeah. So it didn't, it didn't help, but my feet were just too cold. Yeah. 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 So like, so like the tactic that I had in my head, right, was uh, fall asleep before you really start feeling the cold. Yeah, I did that. Um, and I, that's, that's why we just like, before we went to the tent, we just started fucking downing beers like nobody's business. We're just like, all right, can we, can we can we down another bit? Yeah, let's do yeah. it. We fucking we fucking need it to sleep in this weather. Uh, so we after we down the beers um, and I start cuddling Connor. Um, it, it worked. Like I fell asleep actually pretty fast. Yeah, me too. I, yeah, I, I've, I've got a good amount of sleep. I think. Yeah, so Not good quality sleep. I felt no, rough. But. Yeah, I, I got like a good three four hours of sleep yeah. because I remember waking up at around 4 a.m. And that's that's when it really started to hit me the fucking situation I was <laughs> yeah. in. Right, that <laughs> was like the minimum. Wait, what time did you wake up? Or did I, you not sleep at all? I no no. I slept. I probably slept maybe about two or three hours, and then I woke up at like four. Yeah, around four ish. The same thing. Yeah. And then I was just like, I I can't. I can't. I checked the uh, temperature. Yeah. It was like minus six Celsius, yeah. and I was like, fuck it. See, <laughs> see, I, yeah, I I know that if you wake up and you actually start looking at your phone or stuff, you yeah. will wake up. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So every time I woke up, because I woke up sporadically throughout the night, I would just immediately force myself to not do anything and go back to sleep. Yeah. yeah. So I, I got to sleep until around 5.56, I think I remember. I, yeah. I just, I got out of the tent. I was like, yeah. I need to start walking. At that point it was like four or five degrees minus. Yeah, yeah. so and, I, uh, I, I got out at like 4 a.m. and with like all the clothes I had on and I was just like, I'm just gonna go for a walk. Cause well, like, yeah. this is the only uh, way I can I was up. I was so much colder walking. Really? Yeah, cause I had to, I had the problem of what happens when you drink too many beers? You need to pee. Yeah. Right. And so I really, really needed the pee. Yeah. Yeah. And the toilet was very far away. Yeah. So I walked to it. I bought a coffee from a vending machine there to heat my hands up. Yeah. Cause I was using, I paid a hundred, I paid a dollar every time I needed to heat my hands up. I was so cold. I didn't even give a shit. I didn't drink the coffee. Yeah. I just used it as a hand warmer. Yeah. yeah. It, was like, it was like saving my life. It's like my lifeline. Yeah. And, uh, I had gone through like four of these $1 <laughs> coffees just to keep my hand warm. Cause I was like, <laughs> Oh my God. It was awful and it was yeah. it was dreadful. And I, I had to go and pee and it, yeah. peeing was painful. But in this, luckily the one saving grace of this campsite was at the hotel, the, uh, not hotel, the, the toilet, thank God, praise Japan, had a bidet and bidets have a t heated, heated toilet. toilet seat. So I sat on this toilet seat for a good 15 minutes just going, <sighs> <laughs> just knowing that my ass was being warmed gracefully. It was yeah. amazing. One of my biggest fears when it goes to the camping, right, is having to pee after I after everyone's fallen asleep, mm. right? Because I have the f oh, smallest fucking bladder in the getting world. Getting out of the tent. <clears throat> yeah. And like getting out of the tent and uh, waking everyone, everyone up um, as you're going out the, the tent to pee, which sometimes if I'm drinking, I need to pee two or three times. Time, I'm just bringing yeah. adult diapers. Yeah. Luckily this- <laughs> It'll warm you up. Yeah, yeah honestly, no, honestly, I'm, honestly. I'm bringing adult diapers Yeah, it would, it, would, it, would, it, would, it would serve two things. It would warm up my, my legs and my yeah. lower half of my body. And uh, I wouldn't need to worry about peeing anymore, yeah. right? So I was like, hold on, I gotta warm up. I, I actually remember even, even before he went to bed, I remember telling these boys about my irrational fears when it comes to peeing when I'm camping. So <laughs> did you boys remember this? I remember it was stupid. It was like, because, uh, because uh, we were talking about horror movies before, like something to do with horror movies. I can't remember, I was pretty fucking drunk. Um, but anytime I pee in like the wilderness, like every, anytime I pee in like the wilderness, mm. like, like camping or whatever. Um, so you go up to like a bush or something mm -hmm. and it's like it's like a bush that extends as far as the eye can see. Yeah, you know, yeah. Anything can be fucking hiding in that bush. I've seen <laughs> enough horror movies to know that there's a, there could be a fucking monster or fucking <laughs> Jason on the other side waiting to chop me up. Oh, there could be anything. So like, I have this <laughs> irrational- like, what are you five years old? Like, <laughs> like yes, that? Joey, I'm think, five years old. Like okay. Dexter's chilling in the bush waiting for you. I could be, you know, so, so like ever since I was a kid, every time I would go up to pee by myself, like I'd hear the boys just like bantering in the background yeah. and I'd be about like, you know, 20, 20, 30 meters away yeah. in the dark. So they can't really see me, but yeah. they know I'm there. So I'm peeing in this bush and I have this, I always have this irrational fear that something is going to come out of this bush <laughs> and like attack me or grab me or a creature's gonna like fucking chomp me up or something like that. Cause that's what happens in every fucking horror movie. It's always like the guy taking the piss next to the lakeside of the bush that he never expects that he's a bit drunk. That's that's when they die. That's when they always die. Bro, you need to cut down on the horror movies. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so, <laughs> I think Sydney's making you watch one too yeah. many. Yeah. Yeah. 
<laughs> so every time I go pee, I'm like eagle-eyed, looking for like any fucking movement. Every any like any 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 fucking shake of the bush, I'm like ready to like leg it the other way. I don't even care if my dick's out at this point. I'm like I'm like legging it, right? You're, you're, you should be thankful that it was so cold because yeah. if it wasn't that cold, I would have absolutely trolled no, you. No, because 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 it was cold, right? Yeah. So here I am, here I am keeping an eagle eye out of any sign of a possible monster um, that could come out of the bush, right? Um, and then, but me being drunk, someone like one of you guys say something funny, start laughing. Mm. I look over and I'm just like, huh, you know, the boys are just being boys. I look back over and I see something, someone's breath, just like, just like going towards Like me. a white cloud. Yeah, yeah, like a white cloud. I'm like, fuck, there's, there's a monster hiding in that bush. <laughs> And then I soon realized literally half a second in that it's just my piss steaming. <laughs> so I gave myself my, my, piss, my piss gave me like a you mini- You scared from your pee. I did. You're an idiot, John. How do you- My piss gave me like a mini fucking heart attack because I thought there was like a monster hiding in the bush. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God, it's the funniest thing I've ever heard. Um, so um so yeah that 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 already shows how cold it was even before oh my God. uh even even before we uh started sleeping so luckily like i i'd held my piss for as long as i could until like i woke up yeah and i remember waking up and i was you just can't get back in that sleeping bag once you wake up no, no it's not no. possible i gave up no so i remember waking up and i tried to go back to sleep um and of course this was this was the exact moment that uh, Connor and Nabby decide to have a snoring contest. Um, <laughs> it was yes, yes, you guys, de- <laughs> you guys definitely did. It, it was oh, I, I, like I don't, I don't know why they chose this exact moment, right? Because I, me- I remember waking up. <laughs> why do you think I, I got my own tent, dude? I, 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 I remember like, wake- like you can't. You were like four feet away from me, Jeremy. <laughs> I, I, I remember waking up, right? I, me- I remember waking up, and it was like dead silence. And I remember I, I, I had about, I had like a good ten minutes of dead silence, yeah. right? And I remember like. Like, I remember like check my bladder, right? To be like, do I need to pee? No, thank God, I don't need to pee. Thank God, I, that, like my bladder is empty enough for yeah. me to be able to go back to sleep. Yeah. So I like turn over, try and try and find a nice, comfortable position, and then I just I just hear I just hear Connor next to me going, <laughs> <laughs> and then I was just like, Connor, Connor, don't 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 Please. don't don't you fucking dare! And then he doesn't do anything more, and then Nabi just goes. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just like, no, no, please no. I like, I get another five seconds of silence. Connor turns over. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just like, for, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I'm, trying to, I'm trying to get the blood flowing as much as possible. I'm breathing. I do remember that moment actually, because that was around the time where I decided to wake up and all I could hear was like, what sounded like two like really old motorboats trying to start off? It was like, <laughs> <laughs> it was just like a feedback loop. Like you just kept feeding into each other, and I'm just like, I was like, are they? Echoing? I don't. I don't normally snore, but I, when I have to sleep on my back, that's when I snore. Also, yeah. you guys were drinking as well, right? Yeah, so like they, naturally they you snore more when yeah. you drink. Yeah. But like that wasn't the only dilemma I had to go through because um, now at this point I had sobered up a lot more, at least mm. a lot more that I could definitely, definitely feel the fucking cold, right? Mm-hmm. Um, so I realized that uh, being in a tent, you can warm up your body, but the air in the tent is still cold. Yeah. It is still cold air. Um, so I was trying to breathe through my nose and I swear to God, every, br- every breath I took was like freezing the moisture inside my are nose, saying, right? Are you saying you became a mouth breather? No, I, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I, so so like while, while, the, while these guys- Survival while these, tactics while to be a mouth breather. Guys, while these guys are- Having a fucking snoring contest. I'm I'm here trying to trying to successfully breathe through my nose without it hurting. And after about five minutes, I'm just like, what I, you, I gotta what become is this a fucking demon slayer. <laughs> I'm, I'm like, like I'm I like, have to master the breathing I'm technique. Like, I'm like, I've become. I'm going to become the thing I detested. <laughs> I became a mouth breather. But th- even that, like, didn't help. Like, yeah. I, I became. I I tried breathing through my na- my mouth, but it was still too fucking cold. Yeah. Mm. So I had to like take my, I had to take my jacket off, right? And try to fashion this kind of pillow scarf kind of thing yeah. where my face was being covered. Right. So that like, I had enough air to like, so like it was, you it was like- playing it's, Dune or something? Yeah. yeah, 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 kind of. So I, I tried to, I tried to masquerade this fucking mask on me where it had enough, I had enough air um, to breathe, but it was also insulating the cold air. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, that didn't work because <laughs> then um, if anyone's tried to sleep with like the 
blanket over your head, you soon realize that uh, you can't fucking breathe. Yeah. <laughs> you, you can't breathe. It gets you very get, stuffy. Yeah, you get, you're gonna get very stuffy. You're probably gonna die of like carbon dioxide poisoning. Yeah. Um, so basically I had to make the choice of trying to sleep, um, suffocating myself or freezing my lungs and uh, neither, Neither choice sounded like a good choice to me. Yeah. So here I am for 30 minutes. Like I, I would I would put the cover over my head, try to breathe through it for a good like 30 minutes. Doesn't work. Take it off, find another position. It sounds like you were like one step away from like just breathing your own farts for yeah. warmth. I mean, that might've <laughs> honestly been the best yeah, solution yeah. in this case. Honestly, I, I, that pr if, I would have taken any fucking solution that worked. <laughs> um, but like eventually me, me trying to go to sleep, like Connor eventually wakes up and he goes out the tent. Um, and so I, I try sleeping for another, another like half an hour to 45 minutes before mm. I just give up and just try going out. And th at that point, everyone's already out. Yeah. Um, so I didn't know what these guys were doing. I thought, I thought Connor had like gone for a walk or something. Um, I thought, you know, I thought maybe they'd gone back to another 10. I, I had no idea what they're doing. Cause I remember them talking outside, but when I went outside, nobody was there. So. So I, I remember, um, I remember like trying to find where everyone was, and then for some reason I just I felt the car, or I heard the car <laughs> engine like purring. Yeah. Right? And I'm just like, why is the car on? What's what's going on here? And keep in mind, I had contacts on uh, before I slept, so I had to taken them off, so I couldn't see shit. Yeah. So I was like trying to feel my way through. Everything was blurry for me. Yeah. Um, so I go towards the car, and I see Connor just fucking sleeping on the driver's <laughs> seat. <laughs> These motherfuckers had. G had gone into the car, Big brain. had gone into the car, turned the engine on <laughs> and just slept in the fucking car. Yep. Fuck the camping trip. <laughs> they had gone back to civilization, right? Listen, listen I, in my mind, I'm like, listen, I've slept. It's 6 a.m. It's technically morning. Yeah. I've awoken. Now I want to get warm. I'm, t I'm going to the fucking car. Yeah. Like, yeah. I, I, Cause at that point, I was like, what do we actually do? I don't know what to do. I was like, yeah. I can't sit on the toilet for hours. Like, <laughs> like we're not gonna do, we're not gonna leave for a few more hours. Yeah. And I was like, there's nowhere I can go to get warm. All yeah. right. I, no one can accuse me of not camping. I slept in the tent until 6 a.m. I'm now going in the car yeah. to heat up. So I, I, I joined him, uh, obviously, to yeah, warm up a turn bit. Turn the engine on for a bit. And yeah. then it got hot enough. And then the sun was starting to come out, so we just turned it off. Yeah. yeah. And then we just chilled in the car. <gasps> I slept for like yeah. four hours. Yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm giving them shit, but the only reason I'm giving them shit was because I saw Connor sleeping in the car. I'm just like, you fucking <laughs> genius, big brain mode. I like excitedly, Galaxy brain. I excitedly opened the car door, being like, you fucking geniuses. <laughs> and then I quickly see that all the fucking seats are taken. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I, originally I was like, come on, Jay, let's go in the car. I'm yeah. going to go yeah. in the car. And I didn't want, I didn't want all this <laughs> wasted electricity that yeah. I'm using because it is a <laughs> massive waste of electricity. Yeah. But at the yeah. time I was like, I'm going to die. I'm yeah. just going to, I'm going to get in the car. It's minus yeah. four, fuck yeah. this. Uh, uh, the other people were taking photos of Fuji. Yeah. And they were dying for their craft. And I, I salute them, but not me. I had nothing to gain from that. Yeah. So I was like, I'm going in the car, Jay, come on in. And then, and then slowly everyone started trying to get in the car because <laughs> they were also freezing. And, and then so, it basically turned into like a sauna where like people yeah, were coming yeah. in and out, like just yeah. trying to warm up. Yeah, because like I opened the car door and every fucking seat was taken. <laughs> and, it, and like, it wasn't filmed because like, I'm glad it wasn't filmed because it would have quickly turned into like the salty of mo saltiest mo moment of trash taste yeah. this year. Cause I was like, fuck these guys, <laughs> fuck these guys. Fuck them, and I went for a walk trying to figure out how I'm going to warm myself yeah. up. Right? It was great, like because the car was slightly on a hill as well. So when I uh, reclined the chair, yeah. it was literally like a flat bed. Yeah, yeah. In this yeah. land and the aircon was just blasting. <laughs> yeah, it it didn't great. really do anything for the first like ten minutes because because yeah. the car wasn't moving. Yeah. So it was just like, what are we doing? Yeah. So I'm I'm still like tired as fuck. I start walking around. I try taking some nice photos of Fuji, but at this point I'm like fucking dying. I couldn't even I'm give sorry, a shit. You could you could have got in. You know, we could have no, squeezed there, in. There was literally no space. It could've was got e the boot. E every every <laughs> space was taken. <laughs> we could have we could have stacked. No, no. I, 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 I found a, I found my way though. I, I found a way to warm myself up. Um. So this is this was like me using like 100 of my brain, right? Because uh -huh. I'm I'm an engineer, and what do engineers do? We problem solve, yeah. right? And I did that too. <laughs> yeah, you did. I, I can't blame you for not problem solving. <laughs> Unfortunately, I couldn't go for the same solution because uh, Nabi was like fast asleep. So I couldn't be like, Nabi, give me the car Get keys. the fuck out. <laughs> Get the fuck out. Let's go into the car. Give me the know? other car. <laughs> so, um, so I walk over uh, to take the piss, at the, you know, to take a piss in the toilet and I see the vending machine. And yeah. then and then like the fucking, the fucking bulb just like lights above my head. Yeah. I'm just like, guys, I figured this out. <laughs> so I go back to my tent. I get my wallet, right? <laughs> I get my wallets and 
I just I just start putting coins in. I start buying coffee. Cause Connor- How, huh? how many did you buy? I bought like six oh in the end. Oh my God. <laughs> so, that sounds more inefficient than using the car. Probably, it probably is, but I, I that, that was the only solution I could come up with, right? Why did you not just jump in the other car? We had it's, two cars. It's, it's canned coffees, by the way, not yeah. like- in So, a, so to, to explain, we had a vending machine there and Japanese vending machines have this option where some of the drinks are warmed, right? And that was the only source of heat I could find in like a five mile radius at this point, right? So, so here I am like <laughs> spending like a hundred yen for like a coffee, which to me, I just like, I just like heat packs, right? Yeah. And I, I start packing them into my coat, mm. right? I, I, at this point I, I like, I, I like actually like start rationing them. So I start, uh, so I take about six coffees, fucking rush back to the tent, go back into my sleeping bag. I like throw throw two cans at my feet because that's where my feet, my foot was the coldest. And the rest, I start like packing in my winter jacket. So I pack some 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 in my like my bottom God. pockets, some in like my side, my sleeve pockets, some yeah. in my side pockets. Have the best fucking sleep of my life, man. <laughs> <laughs> it worked. It actually fucking worked. I got oh. like I got like some proper air circulation in this fucking sleeping bag, man. I felt, I felt so rough the next day. I slept like ten hours as well. I just felt awful. Yeah, yeah. I, th I think because there's something about eating like just meat as well that just makes me feel awful. Yeah, I get that. Uh, yeah. and, and a lot of beer. We didn't have the best too. diet the night yeah. before. So. Yeah, when I eat just meat, like mm. only meat, I feel like my body feels like beaten up. Like yeah. I need some like something else to help stomach the blow. The yeah. 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 So yeah, uh, more of the story is- um, you be, know, more prepared. be more prepared. <laughs> Don't underestimate the winter. Yeah, uh, I thought it would be fine. Who gives a shit about what Bear Grylls says when you could just get warm coffee? That's the secret. Just That's the, the secret. Car. Just get in the car. <laughs> Why did Bear Grylls not go to the nearest vending machine? <laughs> All you need is a combini. Just go to a vending machine. Get just some, go to a vending get, machine. Pack right? yourself some warm fucking coffee and just use that shit. Warm yourself up. I don't know why Russians are complaining. Like I've seen Siberian winters. <laughs> just, need a, just need a vending machine, yeah, isn't it? Well, sometimes machine. Their, their car engines freeze. Yeah. <laughs>